we go to derive the depletion curve of a linear reservoir. In general, a reservoir will have an inflow, an outflow, Q, storage, and possibly change of storage over time. Now when we know that we have a linear reservoir, we know the relation that storage is proportional to outflow and hence change of storage is k dq dt and the second relation that we know is the water balance which says that change of storage over time is inflow minus outflow and as we're talking of a depletion curve there will be no inflow and hence change of storage equals minus Q. We can combine these two equations and this will result in combining one and two Q equals minus k dq dt which is a simple differential equation that we can solve remember q is a function of time and the solution is a negative exponential function qt equals q0 the exponential function of minus t over k. If we draw this solution in a graph with on the horizontal x-axis t and q on the vertical axis at t equals 0 we'll have q 0 and the exponential function and the depletion curve will look like this at t is 0 there is a tangent The tangent dq dt is q zero times minus one over k and the exponential function over minus of minus t over k for t equals zero this changes into dq dt is minus one over k q zero so the line the tangent at q zero as the equation q is m minus 1 over k q 0 t plus q 0 and we can check that at q 
equals 0, t is k, meaning that our tangent intersects at the horizontal x-axis at t equals 